Welcome back to the channel. You know that I like my pen testing gadgets and uh, pen testing tools, Wi-Fi pen testing tools, etc. And it's 2024 and underneath this mask is my latest and greatest addition to my collection. And I am very happy to say it's also my favorite tool I have amongst everything. And I'm not gonna waste any more time. That's it right there. No, that's not just a USB. That is a diabolic drive. This gadget's a bad USB, but this is the newest generation of bad USBs. This would make the USB rubber ducky uh, look ancient. This thing has so many features and benefits to it, and I can't wait to dive into this, into the video and show you. Before we start this video, I want to give a shout out to Omar Youssef. He is the founder. He handcrafts each and every device. So you can imagine the passion that goes into this product. And I can tell you from my hands-on experience that you can feel the quality of this product. It doesn't feel flimsy. It just feels like a good product. It's already well polished and it's brand new. And out of the box, it's easy to use. So you can plug and play. And if you're an enthusiast, there's even more customizable things you can do to make it even more effective for your penetration testing. Full disclosure here, I am not partnered with this company. I was just simply sent this product to test and I fell in love with it. This device is good for whatever type of background you have. It's good for beginners. It's good for enthusiasts, um, really experienced people in the field. The ease of use of this device makes it very dangerous and also very effective. Now let's get into why this device is so special. Stealth. This thing is stealthy inside and out. When you first plug this device into a computer, it behaves just like a regular storage device. You could add files to it. You could save things to it. You would not think that it's a malicious device at all. Even when you go into the device manager, it will show that it's just a regular USB flash drive. Which brings up the next point is that you can buy these cases that fit over this device to make it even more believable that it's just a normal usb even though it's not it takes to the form factor here it fits in most usb 0.3 cases which is a little bit different than the usb rubber ducky in the background here all i did was swap out a cheap usb uh drive i had with the diabolic drive you see me do the process here i take it apart I dump out the usb put in the diabolic drive i'm gonna put the case back on it and as you see here you can't tell the difference now it looks like a regular usb when you plug it into the computer it behaves like a regular usb the computer will I identify it as a regular usb a kingston drive and you couldn't tell the difference and it will continue to lie dormant until you're ready to start pen testing all you got to do is connect to it wi-fi you're gonna put in the ip address and you're gonna see the interface right here it's super easy to use by default it's just spectating it's acting like a regular usb until you activate the diabolic drive so you go ahead and hit run and it's going to connect and change it from a normal usb to a penetration tool and you're able to send the payload now. so just to recap this thing was an innocent usb storage device until you hit a button and now it is ready to attack ready to penetrate so let's do a live test so you guys can see how this thing actually operates in the field first things first you got to plug the device in and it's going to behave just like a normal usb you're going to see that it's going to pop up as a storage device the victim or the user that you're testing on is going to see the same thing exactly it's until you activate the diabolic drive you can actually insert the payload and for this live demonstration i'm just doing a simple rick roll payload this is just a proof of concept youtube i'm testing on myself so there's nothing wrong here just spreading awareness that this stuff exists so literally less than a minute ago this was a harmless usb storage device and now it's back to being a harmless storage device where it will continue to lie dormant until you activate it again. It's as simple as cutting and pasting the payloads you want to do right in the interface here. And when you're ready to go, or when you're ready to test, you can reconnect it and you just hit run and it will send it. If I had to compare this device to another device that acts and behaves a little bit similar, it would be my Raspberry Pi Zero W that I have programmed to be a bad USB that you can operate using Wi-Fi, but it doesn't have the stealth tech that this thing has. Like the other thing is bulky. You have, you have to plug it into a computer and pray nobody sees it. Um, with this device, I mean, you have complete stealth. Like it looks like a USB drive and it behaves like a USB drive and you have all the hidden benefit of a bad USB that you could access remotely. So how much does something like this cost? Well, you can pick up one of these for just a little over a hundred dollars. Which is now, crazy to say, because if you were to get a USB rubber ducky, you're looking at about $80, but it doesn't have half the tools that the diabolic drive has. This is more comparable to an OMG cable, which is $180. So you get all this functionality, all this stealth for a little over a hundred bucks. That's incredible. It's user-friendly. 
it's beginner friendly it's enthusiast friendly it's just a great all-around device that's created by somebody that is really passionate about this product and again not sponsored just really excited about something like this this is my one of my favorite penetration testing tools gadgets that i have and my subscribers are one of the first people to actually see this device and actually really hear about this so i hope that you guys grab these things before they go because uh I believe there's a limited supply because again these things are handmade and this is like a brand new product it's just still technically in a beta phase but it works so it's gonna be even more things to come and more probably capabilities with this device as it grows um and you can get on the ground floor of it and that's really exciting too so i look forward to making more videos with this device i'm going to put a link in the description this channel is all about beginner friendly tools and i'm very thankful that this was sent to me to test i really really thoroughly enjoyed this device if you like this video please leave a like and subscribe again shout out to omar youssef for sending me this device make sure you go check him out his stuff will be in the description as well and uh, remember until next time safety is an illusion